The Central Coast is mourning the loss of a popular politician. Kacho Ashajian, who represented San Luis Obispo County for three terms on the California State Assembly and also served on the San Luis Obispo County Board of Supervisors, died today. KSBY News reporter Michael Torres is live in studio on what Ashajian meant to the local community. Michael? Richard and Karina, Kacho Ashajian was well known across the Central Coast and state for his role in local business and politics. People are now remembering him for his kindness, dedication and commitment to his community. Being able to work with everybody to, with all concern and be able to, to help the district was a big accomplishment for me. Kacho Ashajian lived the American dream. He was born in Lebanon before immigrating to America, where he would go on to graduate from Cal Poly. Cacho began growing his business on the Central Coast, owning several gas stations in the area. San Luis Obispo County voters elected Cacho Ashajian to the Board of Supervisors in 1998. He served on the board until his election to the State Assembly, representing the 35th District in 2010. Those who knew him are now remembering his legacy. He's the true immigrant story, and he did it not... Um by excelling within the Armenian American community. He did it by excelling in his local community where there are not a lot of Armenian Americans. People didn't like Contro, they loved him, and for good reason. So you say you've been a good girl? You're going to school? The tributes to Ashajian are pouring in. Current 35th District Assemblyman Jordan Cunningham said in a statement, Kacho was my friend and mentor. He was a true public servant and an American success story. Cacho leaves a legacy of devotion to community, energetic representation, and consensus building. Our sincerest condolences to his family for their loss. Today is a sad day for the Central Coast. Representative Salud Carbajal tweeting out, Very sad and to hear about Cacho's passing. Cacho taught us how to always strive for what's best for our communities, and he delivered results. Community members are also sharing their thoughts online. Condolences to his family. Great man, and he accomplished many things to be proud of. He was an amazing human. May he rest in peace. Thanks to Cacho for all he did for our community. My condolences to his family. A wonderfully generous man. Cacho leaves behind a wife and two children. His family said he passed away peacefully this morning due to health complications. He was 68 years old. Live in studio, Michael Torres, KSPY News. All right, Michael. And the Ashajian family has provided us a statement regarding his passing. The Ashajian family is thankful for your support and sympathy. The outpouring of calls, messages, and prayers is a true testament and reminder of how many lives Cacho touched. At this time, the family appreciates privacy as they mourn the loss of a remarkable husband, father, and public servant.